Well, it's the gruesome video we first showed you back in June, a pit full of bones and body parts with a horse's head clearly visible. Animal Recovery Mission founder Richard Couteau went undercover to shoot that video, and he says it's grisly evidence of a serious problem with illegal horse slaughter in Hillsborough County. And tonight we have an update for you. There is an arrest, and the first of its kind in the state of Florida. Cynthia's here now with more on this new development tonight. Cynthia. Well, Kelly, this arrest was made recently, but the alleged undercover buy that led to it happened last February on a farm in the Citrus Park area. Richard Kudo calls it a step in the right direction, but says there's much more that needs to be done. His name is Jorge Ortega Jr., age 26, and he just became the first person, not just in Hillsboro, but in the state of Florida, to be charged with illegally selling horse meat for human consumption, a felony under a new Florida law passed just two years ago. Kudo of the Animal Recovery Mission says Ortega's the man in this video he secretly shot selling 40 pounds of horse meat to him and an undercover USDA agent last February. Arm targeted six illegal slaughter farms in Citrus Park in Hillsborough County um, well over a year ago. And he had his hand in many of those farms as far as killing of the animals and selling their meat. In a phone interview, Kudo told me he's happy about the Ortega arrest, but still insists the problem hasn't gone away and affects not just horses, but all sorts of animals. There are a lot of, a lot of illegal slaughter farms in Hillsborough County in the Citrus Park area that need to be hit, closed, and animals rescued. Um, you know, these are violent, violent places, and, uh, you know, no one wants these properties as their neighbors. A spokesman for the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office told me they're glad to make that arrest and hope to see the case fully prosecuted. It's a third-degree felony that carries a minimum of a year in prison. He also says their own investigation didn't find the horse meat problem to be as widespread as Kudo maintains, but they do hope this arrest will be a warning. Ortega was released on a $2,000 bond and is due back in court next week. Mark. Cynthia, thanks.